Hey there, my name is Jup and this is a day in the life of an Imperial Chemical Engineering student. The day starts with a quick hit of the gym, it's leg day so here's a video of me walking down to do some post-workout cardio on the rowing machine. And of course, you have to stay hydrated so bottle of water too. I like to start my day with a bit of light reading, so right now I'm reading What We Owe the Future by Macaskill. And of course, after gym, necessary to have some protein, so let's make some protein, there we go. Now I've got my protein, I can start the day. So I'm going to start off by doing a bit of work. So with my blue light glasses on to prevent any eye strain, we're going to work on something called GAMS, which is about process optimization. And here's a quick snippet of me working on the software. After coding for an hour and a half, it's time to go into university. We're going to meet our lab group, and since it's a Tuesday, we're wearing a turtleneck because it's Turtleneck Tuesdays. I jump on the train and get ready for my journey. It's a long one, about an hour and a half. So sometimes there's not always internet, which is why we resort to this classic game. We then get off the train at South Kensington Station and walk our way down to Imperial College London, which you can now see in this shot. I'm on my way to the Imperial Chemical Engineering Department, which is located in the ACE Extension Building. We walk past the state-of-the-art carbon capture pilot plant to find our lab group, who we've worked with in the last two weeks in the labs trying to explore the effects of baffles in an agitation tank. You may recognise Charvin there from a ChemEng Weekly video, and he's also a part-time photographer. Here's some photos he took, follow his account called Shots by Charvin. After dividing our tasks and understanding what we're going to do for the lab report and the presentation, it's now time to pack up and go home. Around the time, it's exactly 5 o'clock, so it's time to dash to the station, walking past this beautiful chemical engineering sign, before giving my camera a quick clean on the way home, and watching a process optimization lecture just before we go to sleep, as that's what we were working on earlier. Thank you for watching, and be sure to follow for more.